Welcome back to Watsonville, California at the Monta Vista Christian School. Now, I've begun working on the, the opening chapter, uh, the hook, how important it is. So here's the drama. We've been working with decades of disengaged teachers. Uh, we're assuming that they don't care. They're the scapegoats for a lot of the problems in education. But again, what if it's not disengagement as the issue? So here's, here's the drama. What if disengaged teachers are wounded warriors? What if it's the battle for the hearts and minds of the kids in classrooms? And we're sending wounded warriors in to try to deal with that. So how can a wounded warrior rescue a child who needs more help, more care than in any time in history? The complexities of the classroom are nothing that we ever grew up with. So that's kind of the opening hook. We need to develop it with some great stories. We have the John O. story uh, at the first summit. I don't know if you remember if you were there when he got up and shared why he left education after five years. And his comment was, when I started having to give out of my essence and not out of my overflow, uh, I had to get out. Now, that was powerful all by itself, but I followed it up at dinner with him and said, well, tell me the story and boy that story was heart-wrenching the choice he had to make almost like Sophie's choice you know do I stay and help these kids that I know are being abused at home and I'm the only safe person they have or do I die trying uh, wow that that's a hard choice to make and so many teachers have had to make similar choices so we we really want to come with this very powerful opening and instead of framing it as teachers who don't care, what if it's teachers who care too much? And because of that, they're, they're just wounded warriors, um, not resilient uh, to be able to handle the emotional load and the cognitive load that every day brings.